Emergency service workers are taking advantage of a special volunteer program to help improve their rescue response times. Sky News has been given exclusive access to a training base in Sydney's West where crews are learning how to help critical care patients. Here it is. They're Australia's unsung heroes. On the board, on my count of three. Yep. One, two, three, move. Working on the ground and in the sky to help those trapped in dangerous situations. It's really important to get off the ground as quickly as we can and get the doctor to the patient as quickly as we can. So uh, they can launch in four minutes uh, and then, uh, depending on the flight time, but importantly, we're getting to you know, all of these complex cases uh, with, within an average of about 18 minutes around the Sydney Basin. For first responders, thinking fast and acting quickly is vital to a patient's survival. These volunteers could really be presented with anything. The most likely scenario that they're presented with is, is a motor vehicle accident. Uh, and, of course, in that motor vehicle accident, it could just be a single driver or it could be a whole family. More than 5,500 volunteers have participated in CareFlight's MediSim program since it launched eight years ago. Volunteers include police officers, paramedics, park rangers, firefighters and surf lifesavers, all trying to bolster their first aid skills. Right now, these volunteers are preparing for every life-threatening situation, whether it's a car crash, a house fire or even trying to prevent a drowning. Last April, CareFlight also became the first civilian aeromedical service in Australia to carry plasma to accident scenes. Since then, the organisation has given plasma to 20 patients. What it allows the doctor to do is that full range of intervention on the side of the road to start treating uh, and, and really start to save the patient's life. Whereas previously, some of that intervention would only occur once the patient's back in the hospital. It's hoped more volunteers will be recruited into the program as workshops are held across other parts of New South Wales, Canberra and the Northern Territory. For those interested in taking part or hosting a MediSim workshop, contact CareFlight for more information. Katarina Stefanovic, Sky News, Sydney.